Well, there are the three types of tests that we have now, remember, is the PCR, the more specific and that identified part of the virus, is said very easy to do because we put a small swab into the nose and we can take the sample directly from the mucosa. This is very easy to identify. When you have this test, this is the PCR test and we try to identify the virus. The other test, the ELISA test, the antibodies, we can identify either in the blood, directly with a blood sample, or like a sugar test in the uh, finger. We can take in the fingertip, we can take a small sample and put in a, a, a small panel. So it's very easy to know the antibodies we detect in the blood, the virus we detect in the nose. Now there is another brand new test that we can call also a, a quick test, but it's similar to the PCR. The PCR is a test that identifies part of the virus. The ELISA test, the antibodies, identifies the response of your body to the virus. So is what we call indirect result. With the new quick test, we can identify, it's not exactly the PCR, but it's another part of the virus, but we can identify very quickly in the time of hours. So this is a brand new test that soon will be spread to everyone, and I strongly recommend to those who want to fly, who wants to see any member of the family at high risk, to do this quick test because you can do that immediately and you can have the results immediately. This is in, in times of hours and it's much more specific than the antibodies because the antibodies only said that you had the virus. Obviously if you had the virus in the past you have to be aware that you can transmit it. You might transmit it but the only way to see if it is real risk is with the PCR. But between you have the test, the uh, quick test and then you have the PCR maybe it takes one week and then you have to repeat the test again but with the, the new test I think that it's a wonderful information that you can have practically in hours and you can make decisions uh, much uh, easier and quicker than the other test.